What's up guys, my name is Darius P and welcome back to another Division 2 news video. Today we are going over the PC features and specs. As you guys can see, today is January 9th, 2019 and the PC features and specs have been detailed release. It's March 15th, 2019. We're not that far away, but it seems like it is taking forever. Anyways, let's get right to this. And as you guys can see, this is coming directly from the Ubisoft website. So if you want to go check it out yourself and read it, you can. The Division 2 is rolling towards its March 15 release date. And the development team at Ubisoft Massive has fully optimized the game for the PC. The PC version of the game includes a host of features, including uncapped frame rate. That means if your if your rig, if your setup can run it, it will run it. If you want to run a thousand FPS, you want to run it, you can run a thousand FPS. That's probably not possible though. And uncapped display resolution. Full UI and HUD customization, multi-screen and widescreen support, variable refresh rate support and HDR support. Read on for a detailed breakdown of recommended PC specifications. Now, you can read this, you can go watch this video too. I, I actually, I gotta finish watching it. I didn't watch it all the way to the very end, but I will be doing it after I get finished recording this video but this tells you a lot shows you a lot of the pc features this is an overview overview trailer that is on ubisoft's uh youtube channel i i would play this but i don't want to get hit with that copyright you feel me but we will keep reading on right but you can go in and check this check this video out if you want to minimum to run it at 1080p 30 frames per second operating system Windows 7, 8, or 10 CPU, AMD FX6350 or Intel Core i5-2500K. Now, again, this is minimum. If you want to run minimum 1080p 30 frames per second, I would rather play it on console than do that on PC. Just me. 8 gigs of RAM, GPU, AMD, Radeon, R9 270 or NVIDIA GeForce GTX 670 VRAM 2 gigs DirectX DirectX 1112 okay now this is recommended for 1080p 60 frames per second honestly I would rather play it on console than to play at 1080p 60 frames per second on PC Operating system, once again, Windows 7, 8, or 10, CPU, AMD Ryzen 5, 1500X, or Intel Core, NVIDIA, basically, i7-4790, 8 gigs of RAM, GPU, AMD RX 480, NVIDIA, uh, GeForce GTX 970, VRAM, 8 gigs, DirectX 1112. Let's keep it moving. Now, if you want to run in at 1440p, aka 2K, 60 FPS, Windows 7, 18, AMD, Ryzen 7, 1700 CPU, or NVIDIA slash Intel, they, they're the same people, basically. Intel Core i7, 6100K, RAM, 16 gigs, GPU, AMD, RX, Vegas, 56, NVIDIA, GeForce, GTX, 10. 70 ram vram 8 gigs direct x1112 same same old same old now elite if you want to run at that elite honestly to me elite if, if i'm running 1080p 144 frames per second that's perfect but if you want to run at 4k 60 fps operating system once again windows 7 8 and 10 CPU AMD Ryzen 7 2700X, or you can run the i9-7900X. GPU with RAM 16 gigs. GPU AM Radeon V2. I believe that is 7. NVIDIA, y'all gonna correct me in the... <laughs> y'all gonna correct me in the comment section anyway if this is V2, but I definitely believe this is 7. 
or the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2080 Ti. Oh my goodness, VRAM 11 gigs, direct X 11, 12. Now let's keep it moving. Oh, they just showing the same thing down here, right? But in the picture form, if you want to run, where's the 1080p 144? Who wants to play on 60 FPS on PC? I'm trying to play in that 144, right? Some claims of Division 2 PC spec, same thing. Uncapped frame rate, uncapped display resolution, full UI and HUD customization, multi screen and wide screen support, variable refresh rate support, HDR support. And this is just showing the same thing what you would need. But oh, this is just the minimum stuff. All oh, that good stuff. Those, hold up, hold up, hold up. Those of you eager to save Washington, D.C. from the brink of total collapse can pre order the standard gold or ultimate PC editions of Division 2 from the Epic Game Store or Ubisoft Store. Are these the only places? Well, this is on this is for PC. Additionally, players who pre-order the pre-C version of the game on the Epic Games Store, Ubisoft Store, or select online or physical retailers will get access to the private pater, while other players can register online for a chance to be selected for the Hold on. No, 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 no. That's what I was just about to think is definitely not right anyways if you want to play the beta pre-order the game if not you can register online and have a chance to be selected just a chance to be selected for the beta the division 2 lunches we still don't have a full beta release date but we do all think it's going to be january 18th the division 2 lunches on march 15th on pc ps4 and xbox one will you be playing on pc xbox or playstation me myself i will be playing on pc i was thinking about playing it later on xbox or and or playstation probably like a year or two down the line but if it's not si at minimum 60 fps on console which is pro that's probably not possible not for an open world game like this it, guys, it's just not possible. Consoles are not still not strong enough. Even the Xbox One X, as strong as it is, is not running the division. Not even Division One. It's not running Division. Division Two. Probably not even Assassin's Creed. I don't think. Uh any open world game. Probably like Monster Hunter World, Wild the uh, Wildlands. None of those games probably can't even run Fortnite at 60 FPS. They're just not strong enough. Oh man. Becoming a PC gamer was one of the best decisions of my life. Anyways, guys, my name is Darius P. What platform will you be playing on? And are you going to pre -or be pre-ordering the game so you can play the beta? My name is Darius P. Thanks for watching. I like it, I like it too, baby. <laughs>